Game Legion, they've surprised the whole way through. And look at Heroic already throwing in a couple of tricks here, Jason. They're actually pushing Tessus and Cadian out. And this is so early on. This kind of a push usually slows down, usually you wait around, but they're just going to keep on going. Cadian ready to turn the corner and start with a killer in the semifinals. Take it now. Chaosity deletes Immer as well. And the game is up right now. Game Legion, they just have to go for the B bomb side right here. The game's not up. The game's over. Sound's got another one as well. Isaac with the rebuttal, but again, that flank is going to come in. Shui and Isaac have to fight their way out of this. And at this point, maybe the plant is all they can get. Two versus four, but another kill makes it just three, oh and my. now two. They missed so many shots. What's happened? Kadian trying to see if he can recover for his team. He's going to get the kill on Isaac. And it leaves Suhei here. One versus two, the captain of the team, but he's going to get shot down. Kadian with the triple kill, but that almost got out of hand. Two Galils, one Tech Nine. Oh, nice grenade that lands on them before they even get anything really underway. Stown put under some pressure here, but he's handling things all right at the beginning of it, at least. Emma, though, coming back, and he sprays three of them down. That is a massive way to get back into it. He's crouching forward, doesn't even reload. Just nine bullets left in that magazine. If someone was going to come through here, shush. Oh, actually, Emma, is he going to go through? He's waiting for it on the other side. There we go. But he doesn't quite check it, and shush will take him down. He didn't need to do that. He didn't need to do that. He's opened up the opportunity for Heroic. Two on two. There's no kits, though. Oh, Kios falls next. And it's Acor, a Deagle, all that remains, and tucks himself in. And now shush has picked up a kit. He's got plenty of time for this. And that's a quick shot from Yabby. And the defuse is in. Jabby and Kadian, they are feeling a little bit lonesome over on that A-bomb site. The rotations right now are so far away. Sui is actually going to get caught. Oh, no. That's a little bit of an issue. Shush takes him down. Yabby, he reads this. He knows what is coming next. The flash, the smoke is up, but it's a four versus five. They can afford. They don't have to fight to the death right now. They can go for the retake instead. And I think that's what they're trying to do. Tessus will get blown up, though. a call landing his first kill of the semifinal. And it is a four on four. And with that much damage on Kadian now, actually, Heroic, they're in a little bit of trouble. Yeah, that blast radius is really huge on the map. If people don't know, it's really often that people die in this one. In fact, Acor will end up blowing up. They're going to be able to save the AWP, and they will take out Shush at the end. So it wasn't nearly as bad as it could have been. This might also be a risk, but at least we're not going to be running through the smoke. Let's try Kadian's and see if we can rotate back. It's not, the, it's not a bad move right now. Kadian, he's the only one here. Shush is coming in from CT spawn. He's going to get shut down. They should have known that something was up, but they just weren't ready for it. Shush, good shot onto Kios, but the bomb is still in the hands of Suhei. Oh, they're going to run right into it. Even with the spray down, he mows them all right down. And it's Tessa's on his own with absolutely nothing to do. What a ridiculous setup. It's a huge choke point, so they just get bunched up on top of each other. Tessa's here, trying to do a little bit at the end of the round. Immer's pretty far away from the blast zone, and even Tessus will not be allowed to escape. Gamer Legion, they tie up the game and make it a 3-3. Yeah, and they're gonna they're gonna make a, they're gonna force an awkward decision out of Heroic. Kadian's got 7,800. Everyone else is dirt poor, so they're gonna have to figure out what they want to buy. They can throw an op on Kadian just for the risk with some upgraded pistols around him. But this is a beautiful triple spray down on the transition back. There he is, the tank. Yeah, he's in the arena, a legend of the game. Imagine a world where I'm giving you unique tips and tricks about the game. On top of that, analyzing your demo. He flashes himself in. So hard to do that effectively. Very good. Always leading by example. Meanwhile, Skin Club is taking care of all that drip to make you look like a superstar. Heroics still have no idea what's coming. Heroics alone. Kadian is alone defending this bomb site, and he's going to get aggressive through the smoke. One shot, but that's it. Yeah, they know by the time that they're on the bomb site, and that's too little, too late. Acor's going to find a kill there, and a smoke going up. Shush and Tessas, I mean, you could if you find this kill, no try to way. risk it. Flashed on through. Suhei trying to hunt down Tessas. That is so aggressive, but the fact that he's solo on health, even if he doesn't win the fight. Shush going to be walking in. He could be the guy to open it up, but the truth is, you're right. That defuse kit is worth the entire round at the moment, and he might not even be really trying for this one. Flash to set it up, a little bit of a peek. Chaos good for the kill, and now the kit has been lost and shushed in the crossfire. He'll go down. Chaos and Acor with a double kill each in Gamer Legion, marching on in this opening half. Gamer Legion about to be at seven rounds if they can dodge the Deagles. Emma, oh, actually, 
Usually that spray that he's really, really good at, but this time he's going to get bested a little bit with the 5-7. It's all right, Isaac's holding onto the bomb side. Everyone else is streaming in. The real, oh, the question is down on the flank. Shui could catch him. This is huge. Timing is everything. He knows someone's likely going to come from behind, but he could find Acor, and he will, before certainly falling to Shui. But no, what? not at all. What a turn with the MP9. And it's all come crumbling down. Kios left and can't handle it. Good flank and some really impressive work here for Stown. This first kill is basically for free, but the follow-up one is way harder to get. Oh my god. And this time it's almost like the boldness of having those pistols allowed Heroic to get to jump on some of those flanks, right? Stown making that bold play, pushing up middle, wrapping around very quickly. First time out called for Gamer Legion. Gabby up close. Sure, if you swing into that right now, but what happens if another 20 seconds go by? They're gonna try and see if they can test it out right here, and they just get the opening. Sure, the Molotov is down, but they're still fighting. Isaac, two great headshots to open up the middle with. And it's a three versus four. Tess and down, though. They are aggressive, and they're holding it still. They don't have any more grenades, and they're leaving Stown alone. Jason, this seems like madness. Yeah, because mid's exposed as well. It's Stown, just him. And they're quiet. Tessis is coming back now, but it might be a little bit too late. He's gonna call it in. There's the bomb on the ground, but Tessis is getting overrun. And Stown, he can't escape. He has to stay in this tiny corner to fight for the death, and it's gonna be Acor to take him down. Oh my god, yeah, they're just finding everything. Katie and that rotation getting caught before he get there to help out Stown. Gamer Legion on eight rounds. They'll be able to get towards Donut, but they'll be smoked off. His job here is to just get a kill and survive. That's the only thing he has to do. There's one. The spray on the second is almost perfect, but he'll stay alive. Isaac still living through this one. And now they're up close. Heroic with a one-man lead, but we've seen earlier how quickly that can disappear. One shot for the... Oh, and actually, they're going to be running through. The bomb isn't even planted yet, and they're losing. Gabby and Tessas both, and now some shots are ringing out. Acor. With the AWP, he'd love a bomb plan right now, but he's feeling a little bit worried. <laughs> now Molotov goes down right on top but they have the man lead now. Gamer Legion, they're bringing it back. That's great utility from Heroic. They just get checkmated by one more smoke from Gamer Legion. Plenty of time for them to get this bomb planted safely. Yeah, you're right. Shush, trying to walk through. He's instantly dead. Caught by the Swede on the other side. Sue in the middle, catching the rotation. It's just Kadian. And there's nothing he could do. We've seen some mad clutches out of him in the past, but this is too much to ask for. Sue goes down. A blown rotation, so there was no one to challenge towards Temple on the retake, no one in CT spawn on the retake. They were all just desperately coming through the smoke, and Kadian goes down anyway. The tools necessary to stop this. Kadian will pounce off of the contact from Shush, but it's weaker weapons. It is. MP9 up close. They definitely don't have the tools. Acor does. A massive hammer to shot down Shush and Sui. They might get a team kill in the middle of it. It's a little bit uncomfortable, but they still have the man lead, and Isaac finds a headshot. It is just now on Tess's. They know where he's coming from. He got that double spray down. They know everything. One they, versus two here. They can bail out. Awesome planking all the way to their T-spawn. That's the only thing that he cares about, just getting the information. And Tess's, he's seeing nobody. He can't find it. Emma sneaking up on the other side, and there we go. Ten to five. Gamer Legion. They have arrived in the semi-finals, and Heroic left wanting. They need a comeback, and we'll see if they can. This had better be a start. Here we go, mid-push. Little bit of aggression from the Gamer Legion defects. Oh, Kadian, how does he get two? He didn't deserve it. He had to claw it out of their eyes, and it's just Isaac left alone. So much to do, and he can't handle the pressure. That is the kind of start they were dreaming of for Roy. They had a little bit of a break to just recollect themselves. And now Kios and Sue, if they steal this round back, that would be devastating to Heroic. Shush is making absolutely sure that's not going to happen. And now just Sue left. And I mean, at this point, you could even justify saving the armor. There's probably no wrong or right move here. If you can fight, you know, you can try and swing yourself back into it and just oh. you know, warm up that pistol a little bit. But this round should be impossible to win. Yeah, absolutely should be. And he's not even going to move past this point. Oh, maybe he will. Maybe he will. No kit. And as you mentioned, this is pretty much impossible. He's looking for any peak, anything that someone's going to give him. Tess is in the back lines, trying to cut off the flank. He's going to fall to Stown. That's pistol round for Heroic. Both pistols in their favor. They won't expect this mid-round push through the smoke. Oh, no. The timing here, he's gonna be walking right into Yabby. He sees the shadow, he's good for the one kill, but he has no idea that they're already out. That was a sick move, but it might have backfired in the end. Three versus three here. 
And Isaac going to be making his way through the tunnel, trying to get in there. The Molotov will slow him down. Kiyosun Sue is coming in from CT spawn. They have one smoke left and no defuse kit at all. So they're going to be in a lot of trouble to try and retake this as the bomb goes down, but it won't even happen. Isaac just picking them apart. Stown is on his own. Not a better player right now you'd want in a one versus three, but my god, it's going to be hard to win. Now he does have a chance to maybe slip the net here. Bomb on his back. And he's going to be walking away from that one, especially if they're defusing for 10 seconds. Oh god, that kit could end up making the whole difference here. Kios, yeah, they're going to be smoking it off, but the Stown really care at this point. Tapping the bomb once, he walks right through and Stown, it doesn't get any better than that. Now a lot of trouble, 10 seconds on the other side. He actually will hit him down to 25 health and he has to come off the bomb and Stown in a one versus three to bring Heroic back into this opening map. That is a tough loss to swallow if you're Gamer Legion. You want to put them away when they are down, when they are wounded and feeling weak. I mean, that has already a little bit too late here. Heroic, they're certainly feeling the, the fire at their feet once again. Yeah, great call from Kadian this round as well. They spot the B aggression coming out of cave. So Kadian just says, that's a lot of resources on this side of the map to execute that, but hold the phone. Two kills back in quick succession. Oh, they're going to go for this. Now, why wouldn't you? You don't have that much to lose. And on the other hand, if you win this round, it's going to be shot to them. Good trade once again. Shush out here, he's been found out. They can probably guess where Gabby is. And he's not going to line up for them. All right, they lose what they have, but they wanted to see if they could put some pressure on. Chaos. Good smoke down to try and slow them, but the utility is so good from the heroic side. They pushed him out of there, Sui in the corner, and he's not even ready for that push. Down will go, will get the kill, and Shush is going to keep it going. Kios, he wanted to be the hero to fight his way back, but he can't. Three versus five, another bomb plant, and Game of Legion, they need the rifles. You'd love to see a heroic retake of this one, but it's not going to be possible. He's on an island of his own. So many choke points to worry about. He's been spotted now, and Yabby is just going to stroll in and find an easy kill. Oh, Acor, you better be careful. Good thing you hit that shot by one more. Cadian's wrapping around. So critical to keep this. Oh, shot not baited out. Well done from, from Acor. He's going to survive, but it's a two-round lead still for Heroic. So Tessa's Yabby and Shush might be pulled into this B execute. There's the op again from Acor. Heroic getting picked apart in this round. They've got one final play. This is a desperate play. 20 seconds, but hold the phone. Kadian runs right in and spites Isaac towards that position. Emma, oh, it's the run and gun. The 5 7 coming up. Huge for Gamer Legion. And they will win another round, losing so many in a row. They needed this. And Game Illusion are going to feel fresh once again. Imma, I don't think he spotted anyone on the other side. They're going to be walking through the smoke any second now. He's got Isaac on the crossfire, but it's down. That is a fantastic opening in the middle, and Tessus is ready. Imma, that was desperate spray through the smoke, hoping you get anything. And they can't. Three versus five. And Yabi's holding tight here. If they walk into it, it's a free kill. He's just going to take one step to the right. And he will be dropping Kios five versus two now. It has to be a triple kill. It has to be a triple kill for Shui. They're only going to give him a look of one. Sound is still there in the doors. Acor is getting wrapped a pound quietly. Oh, the transfer is not quick enough. And it's over. Hadian is walking in there. No, Shush is wrapping upon him now. This yeah, is he's done. walking up behind him. He's surely sandwiched in and absolutely dead. Gun barrel is there and Shush not even going to bother with a knife. He'll take him out clean instead. Yeah, they might have been worried about some kind of utility, but it never really arrived, so they're going to know that. Ima. Here. He is on a bit of a flank through the middle, but Jabby's walking in behind him as well. He could get shot in the side of the head, and there we go. Jabby just finding him out in the open. And that's that's another thing that the slowdown for Heroic has given them. Pulls the defense on the other side of the map out of position, and now you've got no idea what's coming. Sound with another Isaac cut off guard. It's all falling the way of Heroic. Masterclass offense on Ancient and Gamer Legion have nothing to say. Stretched apart in this round, Jason. They just got pulled all over the map and they weren't able to handle it. Tessis will take the kill on Sue. And Heroic, they will be at 14 rounds. This has been an unbelievable run. Sure, they're losing some rifles here at the end, but they are happy to try and take this away. They know he will not have the money to rebuy this rifle. Yeah. This is actually super valuable to take out of his hands, and I think Stown's gonna do it. All right, at the end, 14 to 11. 
Gamer Legion have no timeouts remaining to slow down this push from Heroic. You know they're gonna be going for some kind of a push and Heroic's able to pick them all apart. Here's another one. Right through the smoke in A main, Acorn Isaac. Oh, they're gonna meet this. Flashbang is perfect. Handled perfectly yet again from Heroic. Into a five on three and Ima's rifle hasn't even had a chance to say a thing about this round. You know, the one tool that they did have, sure, they picked up an AK here, but Heroic already going to be at the A bomb site, ready to put the bomb down. Kadian picking off Pios as well as he was trying to make his way out. He did have an AK on his hand, so he probably wanted to make some sort of a play. But it's done and dusted here. Sui, he's close. He can stick around, look for a rifle, but he can't win the round. 15 to 11 going to be the scoreline. Heroic with an absolutely world class performance on this second half, showing what it means to be a championship level team. And it's a four round lead, four chances for Heroic to take this opening map of the semifinals. Oh, look at this, smoke in the middle. They're gonna be coming through against Isaac. He's ready to set up another double and even if he's blind, he'll be able to get it. He's running through with a USB out and nearly makes it a triple. Bomb is on the other side, but he's done so much work here. Three versus four. Spray is excellent and right for the smoke. He's going to be catching Yabby as well. All on Stown. They don't have that much to work with Heroic. They've got to be real careful. And Heroic's money is in a troubling position. This might be a great opportunity for Gamer Legion to challenge for overtime. Stown's going to find one. Not nearly enough. You know, and three more to go. They know where he's coming from. I mean, again, you can't really win a round like this. You need a huge mistake right now for the Gamer Legion side. They've already tagged him up. There we go. Imma making absolutely sure. No clutch is going to be allowed for. Good triple on him. He wants an isolated duel. A single one-on-one -on -one with the op in towards the A bomb site. Ima and Isaac are there. They might get what he wants here. Isaac feeling the pressure, getting hunted down. Kadian lets loose a bullet and takes down Immer at range. And Gamer Legion now, they are in trouble once again. Kadian setting up with the AWP. Not quite hitting that shot, but he has a grenade to at least be able to fall back from the position. And Tess is moving up, playing it close with a Tech-9. How do you get through the smoke? This retake has to come through. Gamer Legion, they're in trouble. And Kadian again. Landing another shot on the AWP. Aiko wants to get through. Stout's going to be taken out. It's Yabby now with the pistol. And Kadian hiding back here. Sui, he's run out of time and down he goes. Yabby will pick it up 16 to 13 as that AWP shot echoes through. And the first map goes to Heroic. I think it's Shush Flashbang they have to worry about. If he pops that right over the wall, a little bit of a boost, that'll reveal something. There comes the flash to set it up, and Acor just stuck him back in the corner. They found it, they isolated him, and they've taken him down. Tessus did a good job, he runs out of bullets, but it will not make a difference. Three kills to start this pistol with. In Game of Legion, there's not much they could do right here. No. Try and get some kills if you can, but you're not going to be winning the round. They just got worked. And it's going to be... It's not for that position, right? It's meant to allow them to swing, and unfortunately, yes. they were so defensive and tucked down. And Massively ineffective. Shush falls as well, right at the end. You're gonna have to find a way to forget about that right now. You'll have time after this game, whether you win or lose, to think about it. Right now, oh, in the middle. There it is. Shush, the spray, it's immaculate. Taking down four of them. And Immer on the duelies. Just running away from the action, but yeah, a little display of power from Shush. Yeah, well, give us a little cowboy glimpse if you're Immer. Go for a couple kills of his duelies. Gonna turn around, he's gotta find the range, the distance, the time to pounce, oh boy. Shush with an ace. To start Inferno, Shush gets all five kills and it's two to nothing. Because of the pop flash that was going in, although look at the rotation coming from Gamer Legion. They're gonna have three people here, but it might be a second too late. Smokes are already up and look, double run through into construction. So he gets completely bodied by Stown. And now Kios inside of the bomb site. He needs some backup, but it's not going to be coming. And they just clean it up like it was nothing. Immer and Isaac, they didn't even get to rotate out of the A bomb site. Putting two people in there definitely a little bit out of the meta. It works really well. Immer getting found, although he will get the kill on Stan at the very least. Isaac is under some pressure, and they know exactly where he is now. So one of the rifles gone. Immer has got to be a little bit careful that he doesn't run too close to the explosion. Slowly getting chased down here. <laughs> oh my god. 
Everything is going the way of Heroic. In the waning seconds of that round, they find him with a wall bang. Yeah, he's got a Molotov that he's thrown down and a smoke on top. He had two grenades left and that's gonna open it up, but the boost is completely naked to Tessas. Walking in on the other side now, Sui and Isaac, how do you get back into this round? Smoke up deep, another one going down. There was a gap, but it's gonna be gone instantly. Sui knows he has to do something to get his team back on this one. Even low on health, he just wants to find something. That's Acol. the bomb. The bomb. He can't find the shot though, he did get the first one. Maybe a chance, there we go. He's dropped now. This is a nightmare, heroic. They had the entry, but they could never get the bombs down on the low ground. And Sue going to be able to pick up the last couple of kills there. Acor, though, definitely the one that saved them. They're not out on Banana. They really don't know anything about what's coming next. Stown's going to be creeping on in and might have had the chance there, but Sui, could it be better this time? Taking down Stown, and now they're going to try and see if they can hit this bomb site. Same recipe for heroic. Four people entering. Kios flashed into the fight, but the counter flashes are just as good. Eight ball, on the double, back with a triple, and that will be plenty of enough. That's the firepower that they need. Game of Legion now with a second round on the board. And Heroic get annihilated. Good shooting from Acor, the AWP comes alive. Yeah, we take that. Shush and Tessas both having the same idea to jump up over the top. Flashbangs delay them, and obviously Acor puts a stop to everything. Yeah, and I bet you if Yabby had more health, he would have been pushing Emma running out of the Molotov like that, but didn't really feel comfortable. Kios here, just playing around a little obelisk. He's good for the one kill, and the spray is great! Double on him, and Acor, not even scoped up, but still lightning fast to take down Kadian. Shush and Isaac exchanging fire down mid. Oh, look at, you want to talk about aggression. Pop flash, a chance for one, a chance for two, and even a dink on Kadian. What a nice opening from Suhei. Heroic, they were so far back and they still just weren't really ready for it. Tess is gonna get caught as well. Surely you're not doing anything else that deep on the ramp, really. Yabby brings one back. Yeah, but how do you get past this? As soon as Acor gets flashed off this angle. Whoa, there it is. I guess the answer is you don't. Acor's got them both. Now Tessas is going to be able to help out. If anyone tries to rotate, they're going to get caught by him. You can see he's set up for it here. Isaac not going to get flashed around the corner. And actually, Tessas, he gives up on the angle. And that's a mistake. Maybe Gamer Legion can come back into this round. 40 seconds. Flank is coming in. Yabby, he's got the grenade in hand. And there's the timing. Emma able to pick up the kill. Heroic. They had their opportunity, but now it is gone. Katie in the last one left. In a one versus three to try and clutch this round, but he has no idea where they are. Well, Ima's even given up on the flank. He's rotating all the way back through CT spawn to join up. Kadian sees one. He'll have no idea about the second, a double peak. What a defense from Gamer Legion, and uncharacteristically, Heroic give him the opportunity. They should be feeling it. They're building something amazing here on the first half. Early fight one, Immer again, back on the scoreboard. Sui, wide swing behind the flashbang. And he's at least good for the one. They know Kios, they could see it. He is the one that flew that flashbang. Oh my lord. That's really risky. How bold. Kadian ready to take the fight, but he can't defeat Kios on this one. Shush and Tessa's just left, and they're getting over for a flank. There's the bomb down, and he just wants to keep on fighting. Kios finding more multi-kills. He is building a name for himself tonight. 13 to 5, Jason, on him. Heroics change the timing. They're going to wrap around the bomb site. Oh, Ima and Isaac, are they even aware of the possibility? Are they going to be ready for this? Ima doesn't look like it whatsoever. Made in hand. Oh, pinned down behind the box as well. Gets one. Isaac has helped recover, but Stown is too much. He almost had the second kill, Ima, for a minute. I believe he could. Stown's going to be picking up the AWP. Some shots are ringing out, and there's a good kill. Kios goes out of the round. Acor and Sue, how do you get this retake on? You need to find a kill right now. More grenades are just raining down to lock out that library position. They're trying to run their way through, but Kadian is able to catch one. And all on Acor, he can't get the job done. Nine to six at the end. But Gamer leads you with an unbelievable comeback in the first half. We'll see if it's enough for the second half.
they might keep this semifinal alive a little while longer. Yeah, but overcoming Heroic's defense is no easy task. And once again, we're going to get a CT push on the pistol round out of Heroic. And Kadian's going to have a real early flank. Knows what's coming, but they've got to slow it down. And indeed, they do. Yabby, Kadian, fill up the scoreboard. The dually is just way too much in this one. And Isaac, he snuck back through construction, but they already know they've got him triangulated. And now the entire rest of Heroic are showing up on the other side. So pistol round here. It's going to be good for Heroic. Kadian with the triple. Because Shush is aggressive in mid, so is Stown. They see nothing. They all know it's going to be a B hit. And here we come. Yeah, this boost is going to be impressive. They need the first kill and they need to survive as well. Gabby, oh, actually, Tess is just powering on through. That is a lot of chaos on the B bomb side. Yabby, they still don't know about it, and he's gonna get one more kill, but they catch him for the smoke. And Kadian, do you wanna risk it? Do you wanna wait for the teammates, or do you wanna go through the smoke? And the answer has already been given. Shush has nades, and Stown on the flank. This is a smart call for Kadian to be patient. Yeah, Flash goes out, but nobody really peeking behind it. Gonna be smoked off on the one side. Actually, that smoke will block off Stown, and there's gonna be a good kill. Sui is out of it. Aiko, one versus three, and he's not gonna be able to do anything about it. Shush just going clean through. Oh, man. Heroic winning the early one. Surviving with the bonus round. If you want to go, Game of Legion, it's going to have to be right now. But again, the utility for the Danish side is just overpowering. 15 seconds on the clock. They're running out of time, no time. Jason. They have to go right now, and it has to be flawless. 10 seconds on the clock, and Stown is ready to destroy them inside of the bomb site. No scope for Aiko. Only four seconds left. Doesn't and the matter. bomb plant, they can't get it. They had the kills, but not the time. And that's a worrying sign. Gamer Legion never pulling the trigger on that hit. They were moving into it. This is a great chance for Heroic to springboard this into a suffocating lead. Acor is playing with death. And oh, okay. Somehow he finds one. Sure, you need a flashbang to get rid of him here, or he will definitely get at least the one kill. Stown in the middle as well, holding on his own. Oh, they're coming down everywhere. Stown holding up his end of the bargain, and what? Isaac, he gets a great transfer. I have no idea how. Stown and Shush both blown up, and now the rotation for them to a core, ready to snipe them out of it. Gamer Legion looking for their first round in the second half, and they just got it. Yeah, no reason for Kadian to go for this. Nice round from Acor, but it's all on Isaac. That spin is unreal, but cut into a one-round lead. What a way to start this round. This is nasty. This is what I want to see. He knows there's one behind him. <laughs> what a transfer. 90 degrees of perfection. Yep. You know what's coming. And about at this time, Heroic says, good luck. Shush. <laughs> Have yeah. fun. See what you can do. USP and Boiler. The only presence at this bomb site. And OK. Well, doesn't even get really a chance. Ima adds one. He's going to spray them all down. Quad kill from Ima. And it's 12 to 11. 40 seconds. That one round lead game of Legion. Don't let go of it now. The spray is pretty good with the early from us. And Stown is there to just take it all away. They have the three man set up, and there's no getting through it this time. Isaac. Every single player is going to be coming for him to spray in the follow up. It was nearly good, but. More reinforcements keep showing up to the A bomb site, and Tessis will find him at the end. They will upgrade into at least an AK. Another one as well to be picked up. Two at B now. Yeah, they wanted to rotate back to B off that gamble, but Tessis called him off. Oh, he's so blind down, and now the pressure is on. One misstep here, and he's going to get his face blown off, but he's good for one more kill. Hasn't reloaded yet. Looking for Suhei. Immer in the pit. He's going to be taking a kill and a good follow up. Stown gets blown up inside. He has been the rock of this A defense time and again. And this time they get rid of him. A little bit of alert coming in. Tessis keeping the round competitive. The bomb is only just planted. If maybe one kill, and maybe that pulls the trigger on it. But you're right. This is risky. If they go for it and lose everything, oh, baby, Gamer Legion's going to look good down the stretch. There is the kid on Yabby, but this is a very hard round to win. The Flash is looking godlike at the moment. Tess is making a jump down right into the pit, but Suhei catching it with a mid-air shot! And that will be the end of it. They don't lose the rest of the rifles, but that is very, very risky. Heroic potentially bankrupting themselves. It's going to be 13 to 12. 
you want to try and double down on the aggression and flash your way into the next fight. That's what they're discussing right now. Smoke is going to be going up, and Yabby just hiding inside. They have no idea. Stown is coming in to try and help him out. There comes Yabby, but it's too late. Kios in the double opening, hit a missed shot. The hunts oh, it no in time. He is mad. Why has he done that? This is a major, and he is trying to hunt them down with a knife. Tessis and Shush are left, but there's nothing to recover the round. They can't even really escape. Absolutely bloodthirsty. And look at what they've done. Look at the atmosphere they've created coming from nowhere in this major to be in the semifinals. What's going to be happening? And Sue is calling an amazing second half here on the T side. Oh, good find from Eva. I can't believe it. Gets you a third, just shuts him down finally. But that's job done for Ima as he sits the rest of the round out. Mm, Katie and Stunner just get there, but will it really make any difference? Smoke up, not even gonna really bounce in the right direction, and he just has a USB on the other side. So yeah, he could try some shots through. But I don't think that's gonna deter Gamer Legion right through the smoke. Isaac making it work. Gamer Legion has three chances. Three chances to close this map out, continue fighting in the semi-final. None of them will be easy. Which is why Sound, you can see him towards Pit, is watching for the wraparound, but this is all on KD, and first shot is his, and he delivers. Yeah, taking out Kios is a good start for Imma. Swinging back into it, one kill, one more step in the right direction. Kadian getting hunted down, but he knows Scott Suhe. It's all gone in this one. Acor killed at the end. That is what you want to see out of the captain of Heroic. Four kills to bring it a step closer to the comeback and into overtime. Hell yeah, there's Kadian. What a sequence. If they go B, it's they gonna can't. be a problem. No, they're really running out of time. 25 seconds. You're right. Katie in a new position down in the pit. He does get the leg shot. Imra is coming in from the apartments. There might be a shot at it here still. 16 seconds. Suhi with the one opening down inside of the smoke. He's dropped the bomb on the ground and he continues to spray. This is a gone like defense from Stown and he will shut it all the way down. Acor, there's nothing he can do inside. He is out of time. Stown to the rescue for Heroic as they bring it to a 30th round. Back-to-back -back desperate stands at the A bomb site. First Kadian, now Stown. Could get smoked out, but he's probably gonna try and play around the edge of it. Molotov to slow them down, and now Tess is gonna come coming in for the rotation. He's already running for it. The window is closing for Gamer Legion. If they wanna end this right now with Inferno, if they wanna avoid overtime, they need the entry. Stown, he's good for the one. There's still a slim chance, but the gap is closing. Tessis is inside of the smoke, 30 seconds, and he's walked clean through. Imma trying to recover this round, trying to win the map for his team, trying to get to a third and keep the semi-final alive. Isaac, he's got some health left on him as well, but the reload right on top. Hold the phone, hold on. They're trying to get the bomb plant down. Imma getting blown up, and Isaac, he gets the... Oh! The stunned faces, a shocking upset. We got back three, baby! Just give them one. Just give them a crumb of something to work with to start these maps, and it's a B hit right out of the gates. Yeah, Tessis is set up. He's trying to get some headshots in, but he's been denied. And Yabby's there to help him out, but already gushed it down. Imma can almost make the full 180 spin to get that kill, but not quite. And Yabby, he's deleting them click by click. They're just oh! Canadian with a drive by the takedown. Chaos and Sue and Acor trying to fight their way back, but they're running out of space. There's nowhere left to live on this bomb site. Kadian just running them down. Three kills on him, and now he's hyping up the crowd again. Antagonizing them, Jason. That's a, that's an attitude. This is a round from Kadian that just shows he is here to win this map. That is bonkers. Look how clean he is through the entire situation. Looking for the haters after the fact. One nothing. Yeah, they're just starting to get back. This is really awkward. Shush. He was one second from getting caught under the open. I think he, he was spotted as well. A bit of free entry. Yeah, you're right. They know where he is, and they will burn him out as a result. 
This defense on the A-bomb side, I don't know why they're caught swinging back like that. Emma, that is a perfect double opening and heroic. Three versus five, but they're still fighting for it, maybe more than they should. He's going to continue and gets the spray down near into the quad kill. Acor able to sneak in a bullet on the last one there, but heroic once again is the, the villains, which they're used to being, I suppose. Isaac going to take a stand and shut down Tess. There's nothing saved for heroic. I think they have to be the villains. I don't think heroic know how to play if they're not the villains. Probably true. Way too comfortable. Yeah, no kidding. You have to put a stop to Gamer Legion once the rifles came out. Again, they want to fight mid, and again, miss the opportunity. It's going the other direction. Molotov is going to put a lot of pressure on Yabby, who's now isolated and alone. Tess has creeped up Catwalk to help out. He's brought low, but a good rebuttal to knock out Kios. I mean, that the attempt to throw the grenade almost lost them the round. Two of them very, very low on health, but they're going to go and find a player here again, Acor. Not with his trusty AWP, but with the AK instead, and he's good for the flick. Tessis and Yabby are miles away. He can stop this plant, though. They've just come from A ramp, and Acor's been checking it from time to time. Oh, knife out. A lot of noise being made, and Acor, he's going to go back and check. And that is part of the problem of playing in front of a crowd. It is something that Kadian should definitely know. Or if they will finally slow it down a little bit more. They do have that AWP on the Kadian, and you are asking for that. Is that going to make the difference? We'll find out. Immer, he snuck right underneath, and that's almost a free kill. Spins around, <laughs> what an opening! He is cracked at the middle of the map. Kadian will get one in return, but that also means... And it's all going to be in the hands of Kadian and his op. A quick reload, a deep breath before the action begins. Yeah, flash on over. He needs to have every single shot. Missing the first one already. The flick on the second, not connecting. And now they're getting up close and personal. Kadian, he gets sprayed down. Sue with the double. And Church is so far away that it will not make any difference. Even a kill or two would not have won that round for Heroic. Heroic's one of the deepest teams we have in terms of how often all five players can deliver a solid performance. Don't too often get that extreme blow up, but you get solid performance game in, game out. Against FaZe on this map, it was Shush blowing up on the scoreboard, but now you have nobody. None of the frags coming in for Heroic. That can stop anything. This crowd was silent for a while, but they got something to cheer about. Again, Tessus winning the opening fight against Kios here, but Isaac, he's so swift to respond. And they're going to re-smoke that window just maybe a little bit a second oh. left. <laughs> he gets so much out of that. We're talking about a smoke that's delayed by maybe a second and a half. Yeah, that one flashbang, that was their opening. They needed that kill. Time is running low now. This should be an impossible round. Two versus four. But Sue, everything comes to a standstill as he tries to get that first one. 18 seconds, he's still locked in, and Tessus will find him after going on a six-round lost streak. Shush inside of the A-bomb site. No more smokes for Gamer Legion. It. They've got to cross this with flashbangs. That's all they have, and it might be all they need. Yeah, that's a good setup to begin with. Yabby. Oh, he gets out old. Emma. Everything is working for him right now. Shush and Tessus, they're at CT spawn, and Kadian's on the other side. 20 seconds left. Isaac coming in with the AK and just snipes him out. Holy they were not ready for it. 15 shit. seconds. Clock is running down real low, but they're fighting for it. Tessus, the only one left as the bomb is being planted in the B-bomb site. And he's low on health already. Gamer Legion, the late round calling on this one is God tier. Immer finding another kill, quad in the round, but they have completely outplayed Heroic. It's actually Sue on Catwalk who wins a heads up fight against Kadian Zop. That's mental. And this is it. This round, Heroic had their chances. A missed opportunity there for Yabby that lets Emma know where his position is. Oh, you're right, that was. Yeah. Right. Oh my God. It's not even Isaac, it's not even the Lurk. Kadian gets a heads-up fight with the AWP and can't stop anything. Oh, the pressure mounts now. Kadian must deliver with the AWP, but they know nobody's coming to the B-bomb site. Perhaps worried about Catwalk, but with nobody in B-halls, they have the players in the right position. Kadian reacts quick. He almost got caught. There was no grenades thrown. Good follow-up shot. Kadian, double kill in the round, and that should be enough. Sue, shot in the back of the head. Shush. Hiding on that ramp, and they were not ready for it. Man, that is late. It's really, really late to start to build something here for Heroic, but it's not too late. 
I think at this point, you're also thinking as many rounds as we can get just to give ourselves a chance. It obviously hasn't been a great half so far. And here are the smokes to follow it up. Sure, she's set up for it. He knows that they're going to be coming. It's down and Tessis are in the middle to try and help him out, but he's missing all the shots for the smoke. We're down to 30 seconds. They're going to be running straight on there with the bomb. It's going to be clean for Gamer Legion. They get the bomb plant down. Kadian and CT spawn. He's good for the first one. And this has to be a retake. Heroic have to make this work. Four versus five. And I see oh. it just as Immer shows up. Deletes one. Rushing through the smoke. And he is surely dead. That is way too much. Four versus three now. And Heroic, this retake is looking real hot at the moment. Kios and Acor left. Holding on to the round, but only barely. This should be no way. Heroic, they are hungry to get themselves back and fired up into the game. The Molotov burning up Kios. And now it's all on Acor. One versus four, he gets the first one there, but the bomb is being defused down in front. Oh my god, those are some sickening shots! But it won't make the difference. Oh, right, there we go. Yabby, he couldn't really escape, or if he could, he didn't want to. Hoping to catch Acor in the corner. Tess is right here, out in the open, and even at the off angle, Kios is so good, he's gonna get one more right to the smoke! And inside of the bomb site, Kadian announcing his AWP didn't get the kill. So they know where at least one of them is. Sure, she might be in hiding over at the A bomb site. Yeah, he needs to make a decision. He's got to know they're coming for him. Sticking around behind the smoke for the moment. But the middle of the map is completely compromised. Oh, and so is Kadian. Isaac knows everything. This is so well played. Using the sound, he heard him jumping around. He knew everything. Using he didn't even have to find Shush. They don't care. Using the time as well. He knows that he's in trouble. Kios is hiding over here, and he was the one to open up the round with a double kill, and he's going to get the last one as well. Nice triple on him, and Gamer Legion right back, eight to five. I'll tell you what, Heroic players are starting to look a little nervous. But Heroic definitely are. Double AWP, double MP9, and this is going to be a change of pace now, coming in from Gamer Legion. They want to crack right through the smoke, and Kios, he's good for the opening once again. Tess is trying to be the hero, jumping into that sandwich position, but Kios, the name, what? the AK, he's just using every tool at his disposal right now. And he's done it once again. Kadian and Yabby fighting for this 14th round, but they need more than a miracle to get back into this one. Yeah, that MP9 is not going to be any kind of a stoppage. And Ima, he'll pick up the kill. Kadian on his own, running away with the AWP9 on the side of Gamer Legion. It is quite literally the only tool that they're going to have in the next round. So, yeah, you just sacrifice whatever you can to get this one. Bomb is going to be going up, and Kios, I think, is the only one within range that he could maybe try and hunt him down. He's certainly given it a shot, but Kadian will bring him down. So the orb is going to be saved only barely. But Tessus is still alone. 25 seconds. If Heroic want to start the comeback, it better be now. This had better be the best 5-7 of all time as they jump right down in front. Good shot on the first. He can't land the second. And now Yabby up close. 15 seconds here. Sue not ready. Grenade in hand and Aiko will take one more kill. It's still a 2 versus 2. 8 seconds on the clock and Kadian pushing through before anyone else shows up. His teammate is still behind him. The gun barrel is going to be showing. Ima, he knows. He's got the lockdown on him. The spray on through in the 10th round. Gamer Legion. They're all there the second half if they win the pistol they might make it all the way to the grand final we'll see how that goes after this a passive defense Ima in support who's been absolutely incredible he'll be tested here early yes he will be everything matters right now <laughs> Heroic, they need it, but Ima, he's the leading one all over the place they don't stand a chance Kush now on his own and he will not even set foot on the bomb site he called there to delete him, Game Legion, they finally win a pistol. And it is so close to putting Heroic in the grave. What a time to get it. Man, he passes this test with flying colors. Look at this. Get out of my face, Tesses. What a disgusting display. He has put himself and his team on the Counter-Strike map. 11 to 5. He's right there. Isaac, he's gonna get the early spot on. He's right down below. Oh, good spray. Ima just continuing his reign of terror into this one. And even the MP9 is doing all the work. It's a good, clean shot from Yabby, but it is too little and too late. Kadian, he'll pick up the bomb, but only to lose it a second later. Isaac, rock solid on that triple defense. Yeah, but Ima man, at 12. Ima getting that first kill, the first player who can really aggress upon Isaac.
One AK on Tessa's a hero AK to try and pick this one up, and that's a heroic move in the middle. He's opened it up and taken down Suhei. How much can they build? Just one single rifle in Fave. The rest are all pistols. And Kios, he's feeling a little bit of pressure now. They're going to try and hunt him down. They're coming in from every angle. The spray is good, though. It is a double, and they'll bring it back into a three-on-three -three with the bomb being planted. But Isaac, he sees the weakness and nice, clean shot. Picking up Kadian. Now it's a two versus one as Isaac will get the spray on through, no problem. It all rests on the shoulders of Tessas. They know where he is. Bomb's not for him, he's got a challenge. Yeah, he has to He has to swing on this one, he has to be wide. Ten second defuse, it won't even make a difference. Aiko will take down his countrymen and put Game of Legion at 13 rounds. But if you know the orb on that side, I mean, you could be tempted to go to the B-bomb side because at least you know you're not going to be running into it there. He also is going to be found in the middle, Kadian. He's good in that one. Isaac and Sue. The crossfire. Is it going to be enough? Well, the early spray certainly convincing. And actually, heroic. They decide, you know what? We are not feeling comfortable at all. Yeah, they're calling that bad boy off. Over towards Khan. Sue is going to be here. And Acor is still in a very safe position up in Palace. Will heroic be able to read this? Are you expecting him to still be here, be here after all this time? It's obviously in the back of their mind somewhere. Sue, that's an easy pickup. Acor with a kill. Kadian, good on the flick. We'll put a pause to the madness for just a second. 30 of them left as well. Two versus two here with the spray at range. Kadian, he has to come off the bomb. He's so worried oh. about getting locked down. Wide swing. Acor, that's a ballsy play. He might go for it again here. Kadian on his own back here, and he can't escape the bomb site, surely. Six health left. And this might be what holds on to the semi final for them. If they want to start the comeback, it has to start with a huge clutch right now. He's trained on the angle, but it doesn't matter. Isaac wide swing instead in Game of Legion at 14. They are so silent on that side right now. The pressure is on. Nice <laughs> shot from Acor. Blows Kadian out of the sky. And makes it a quick four on five here to begin the round with. Oh, they're landed on thick now. This yeah. is a Gamer Legion that is not going to let this one slip away. Oh, a little bit of a peek up maybe. Jabby good for the double, certainly. Even if Acor, I don't even know how, but he won the fight against Stown down in the other pass. So it's still a three on three. Yabby will continue. Again, somebody has to be that person to step it up. Yabby now with a quad kill. Looking to try and see if he can get the ace, but certainly he's already won the round for his team. Yeah. That's the kind of performance, but you got to think it's too late, right? Nobody is too committed to the hunt, but they've got him boxed in. And bang, Shush finds him right at the end, 14 to six. Quad kill on Jabby. It's a, a very, I don't even want to call it a sign of life or some light at the end of the tunnel. It has to be a lot more than that. Immer in the middle, immediately back. The boost up, it's a classic. And that's the only thing they really got. They got an M MP9 as well. Oh, actually, Sue, he might be able to get one. The spray continues. It's great. Tess is getting blown up as well. Isaac there to pick it up. And now it's just all on Kadian. One versus three. How did it come to this? They had nothing to work with. And yet, Game of Legion looked better than Heroic on this one. Ima's flanking. There's yeah, a timer on is. this for Kadian that he's not reading. He's not ready for this at all. A little bit of a shot. It's Sui to take him down. 15. Game of Legion with one foot in the grand final. On the verge of it. And that face says it all. Concern and frustration. Gamer Legion is making all the plays on this map. The proactive team. Defensive utility to keep him dangerous and keep him alive for the moment. Oh, look at the bomb. The bomb is actually running back through T spawn. They're going to try and meet up with Stown. Isaac, he's still in the bomb site and he is good for that opening kill. Now, that's going to draw Ima back. That's a huge red flag. They know what's coming. Suhe on the kill as well. And now Yabi and Kadian are showing up. Ima with the spray down. He's so good. The follow up. He is immortal. It's just Tessa's left. And there's nothing to do. Game Legion with a legendary run to make the grand finals of the final major in CSGO. Stunning the Counter-Strike world. What a road for this team to take to get here. The evolution of Shui as an in-game leader. The evolution as Ima as a star emerging so brightly in Paris. Acor and everything he's gone through to become an upper in the grand final of a major.
Gamer Legion have entered Counter-Strike history. Unquestionably so. You see the look on their faces. They can hardly believe it. And on the heroic side, it is heartbreak. Probably the worst loss of their history.